impersonators unite! They're called the Elvis Presley Impersonators International Association. And we attended a recent board meeting at the Sheridan Rosemont. Dig this. Elvis? How are you doing? Good. What's going on in here? Well, we're having a little meeting in there, a little singing. And you are? Dave Ellen. All right, Dave. All right. We'll see you inside. All right. See ya. That's all right. Hey, how's it going? Ben Hollis. Hey, man. Good to see you. Tell us your name and what the outfit is. Uh, we're Ron Bissett uh, with the Elvis Impersonators International Association. All right. So how many Elvises we got tonight? We're probably about 14. Is it okay to call an Elvis impersonator Elvis, or is that sort of sacrilegious? Well, it's not sacrilegious. It's kind of old. <laughs> Ron, how many uh, Elvis impersonators do you have in the association? Uh, about 215 right now. Why do you, why do, you do this? Let me ask you that. For well, the money, no. <laughs> can make a living being an Elvis impersonator, right? Always possible. There's only one Elvis, though. Elvis, whatever he is, if he's alive or if he isn't, God bless him, he gave the world a lot of great music. He was the king, there's no doubt. You can create a spiritual feeling as far as what he's left, what he's done. I think there's a little bit of him in everybody. What does Elvis mean to you? Everything. Yeah? <laughs> Everything. <laughs> What do you think Elvis would think of all this? I think he'd be flattered to death, and uh, he'd love to see what's going on. Ron, what's the mission of the association, or something like it? Well, to continue and perpetuate the music and the style of Elvis Presley. We support uh, our orphan and homeless children's uh, teddy bear program. What's the phone number for anybody who's interested in membership? 708-820-0886.